Exploring Stingrays for Kids Hey there, explorers! Are you ready to dive into the amazing world of stingrays? These fascinating creatures live in the ocean and are super interesting to learn about. Stingrays are a type of fish, but they're not like the ones you might see in a fish tank. They have flat bodies and glide through the water like underwater kites. Imagine a pancake that swims. That's kind of what a stingray looks like. Their bodies are flat and round, or sometimes diamond-shaped. Most stingrays are brown or gray, which helps them blend in with the sandy ocean floor. Some even have spots or patterns for extra camouflage. One of the coolest things about stingrays is their long, whip-like tail. But be careful, because some stingrays have a stinger on their tail. Stingrays live in oceans all over the world, from warm tropical waters to cooler seas. You can find them near the shore or in deeper parts of the ocean. They love sandy or muddy bottoms where they can hide and search for food. Some stingrays even live in rivers. Stingrays are like the vacuum cleaners of the ocean floor. They eat small animals that live in the sand, like crabs, shrimp, and worms. They use their flat bodies to cover their prey and then suck them up with their mouths. It's like a surprise snack attack. Stingrays are graceful swimmers. They move through the water by flapping their pectoral fins, which are like wings on the sides of their bodies. This flapping motion makes them look like they're flying underwater. It's so cool to watch. Even though they look gentle, stingrays have a way to protect themselves. Some stingrays have a stinger on their tail. This stinger is like a sharp, pointy needle that they can use to defend themselves if they feel threatened. It's important to give them space and not try to touch them. Stingrays usually only use their stinger if they feel scared or threatened. If you see a stingray, it's best to admire it from a distance. Remember, they're just trying to protect themselves. If you step on a stingray by accident, it might sting you. Did you know that some stingrays can grow to be really big? Some can be as wide as a car. Baby stingrays are called pups, just like baby dogs. They're born ready to swim and find their own food. Stingrays have special sensors that help them find food hidden in the sand. It's like having a built-in metal detector for snacks. There are over 200 types of stingrays. Some are teeny tiny, and some, like the giant manta ray, can grow as wide as a car. Stingrays don't have bones. Their whole body is made of cartilage. That is the same soft, bendy stuff in your nose and ears. It's important to protect stingrays and their habitats so they can continue to thrive. We can do this by keeping our oceans clean and avoiding activities that harm them. We can help protect stingrays by reducing pollution in the ocean. This means not littering and being careful about what we put down the drain. We can also support organizations that work to protect marine life and their habitats. Every little bit helps. If you ever get the chance to see a stingray in the wild, remember to be respectful and keep your distance. Observe them from afar and appreciate their beauty. In some cultures, stingrays are seen as symbols of protection and healing. They are often featured in stories and artwork. Some people believe that stingrays have magical powers. While that might not be true, they are definitely magical creatures in their own way. Stingrays are truly amazing creatures. They're graceful, fascinating, and play an important role in the ocean ecosystem. I hope you've enjoyed learning about stingrays. Now you can share your knowledge with your friends and family and help spread awareness about these incredible animals. Keep exploring!